Hey everybody, this is the awesome, otherwise known as Darth Necromancy. Uh, just did some work on a laptop pulling the hard drive out. Uh, seemed a little bit unusual how you went about doing it, so I thought I'd run a quick video just showing uh, what I did. I'm working on a Compaq Presario 2700 US. Give me a second. Alright. 2700 US. Okay. Pulling the hard drive. This is the RAM. That's the battery. Hard drive is not accessible from the side of the back back of the laptop. To reach the hard drive, what you have to do, pull out the DVD-ROM side on this side of the laptop, away from the battery and the RAM. So you pull out these two screws right here. That one and that one. The hard drive comes out. Underneath was a blue plastic cradle that the hard drive was screwed into. Once I pulled that, there were two screws I had to pull out to take out the cradle. Then there were four screws on the hard drive attaching it to the cradle. This is the hard drive right here. Alright, screw one, screw two, three, and four. Alright, one of the issues I found because I have a friend who needs to try to recover data from this is that the plug appears to be a proprietary format. Uh, most hard drives have a plug for power and a plug for data. Uh, this obviously has only one plug, so it looks like they've come up with something proprietary that combines them both. Also, too, uh, you see the jumper setting. It is on the bottom. Uh, I assume that is the master setting for the controller, which means slave would be on top or none. Uh, there's really nothing on the hard drive uh, indicating what the setting is.